All right, everyone, I'm going to try to get through setting these up for you. I've um, been sick. I uh, actually tested positive for COVID yesterday, so yay for me. Um, but I'm going to try and get through some of this decorating. i got some friends going to come and help me later in the week. So fingers crossed, wish us luck that everything gets put together by the time we have our party. At any rate, these are the Sinister Gothic Gargoyles. Um, Spirit has re-released them. I can't, you know, everything blurs together so bad. I can't remember if it was the beginning of this. I believe it was the beginning of this season back in June, July. It was one of their early picks. One of the ones that they brought back. Um, <clears throat> I actually found, because one of these was still in the brown box, found a sticker on the bottom that says these were um, sent to someone in 2017 um, I bought these from the lady that I spoke about with the skull fences that got me into um, into uh, animatronics so I've had them if they're six years old according to that paper I probably had them four of those six so um, never opened them never used them so these are the outsides of the box. This one, obviously, you can tell it's got a little bit more wear and tear. It wasn't inside the protective brown box like this one was. Um, they're very heavy. Um, but okay, I'm going to put them outside here as like the entrance to our uh, spooky house, spooky manor, I guess you'd say. So uh, right off the bat, let's just take a look inside. Um, got you some instructions, some fog stuff. Got some screws. Which, oh, God. I did not want to put anything together, but I'm thinking maybe to put the wings on. Um, all right. Well, hopefully I can do this by myself. <coughs> I'm not having the strength I usually do. Let's hope. But it looks like they're just one solid piece down in inside here and then you put the wings on so all right let me try and get this one un, done for you guys and i'll get back to you all right everyone this is what it looks like um i just turned the box on the side and slid it out <laughs> I'm telling you this thing's heavy but as you can see it's got the uh the fog hose and stuff wrapped around i'm assuming right here is your wings so that's how she's packaged up in there all right, let me get it undone and set up. All right, guys, just wanted to show you real quick what I got going on. Um, both of my wings, when I took them out, had the tips broken off. So I am uh, gorilla gluing them back on. Um, and like I said, I, these have been in that building for four years, maybe more, maybe five. But I'm going to say four. Um, so, you know and then like I said I bought them from a lady that was storing them um, so you know no big deal and, and honestly I could have just blackened out the tips and left them the way they are I mean it's a supposed to be a aged gargoyle protecting the entrance to whether you use this for a cemetery a haunted house or whatnot um, but theory is you slide your wings in here, and here's your screw holes on both sides. And it gives you screws, and you screw those in. This is a very interesting panel down here. I've already taken, because of course it's got four screw in law. Uh, no, it's just a pain in the butt to get in this battery compartment. But right here it says volume control up and down instead of a knob. Um, I'm assuming this is on and off timer is what this is so um so you can set it for on for so long and off so long um i just put these batteries in there i'm not exactly sure how old they are but let's see if we can get this thing <clears throat> to work so that being the case i should mash that and it should come on yeah hmm All right, well, <laughs> when all else fails, read the instructions, right? So let me look at that, and I'll get back to you. I wanted to show y'all something. Um, 
So this one's batteries and I uh, was like, fine, I can't get it to work. I probably need new batteries. Let's just hope that's it and not that this thing's broken. So let me open the one that was, you know, inside two boxes and it's probably in better condition. And indeed it does look to be in better condition. The wings have their points and, and everything seems attached well. But as I was unboxing it, I noticed it had a power cord. And I was like, huh, that one doesn't have a power cord. So it being already, you know, well, you see how the box looks. So maybe somebody didn't put it back. Maybe it was used. Um, didn't look like it. I mean, it was all packaged up. But, you know, things run through your mind. So trying to figure out why it didn't have a power cord. And this is why. This one has a place for a power cord right above your uh, right below your timer. So here's your on off. There's your volume. This one does not. There's your timer. No plug in. On off. Volume. So that kind of sucks. Um, because I would really have loved to had two with um timers. Excuse me. I'm sorry. Plug in. So I'm wondering if the new ones are plug in. I'm gonna have to go online and check. Um, we might be doing some swapping out. But anyway, all right. So just wanted to point that out that. Uh, like I said, I, I was, I'm was i assuming these were bought in the same year. I don't know. I bought them from a person that worked at Spirit years ago. They still work there. I'm not going to name because Spirit stalks everybody. And, oh, my God, if you sell or find something from somebody from Spirit, they're going to do everything possible to figure out if they stole it or gave it to you or gave it at a discount. I mean, they are a pathetic excuse for a company. Um, and I paid for them. And... I didn't get them and I didn't steal them and I'm not I'm pretty sure the person that I bought them from didn't either and so there there spirit you're you're covered you can quit investigating everybody on this one <laughs> y'all think I'm crazy but believe me anyway ooh, I might need to take some medicine I got a fever letting out a little little uh, little stuff anyway let me get this one uh, hooked up since the <coughs> wings are good. <coughs> Please excuse me. And uh, plug it in. <laughs> we can we can check this one out pretty quickly. All right, guys, here he is set up. He's got a light here that shines up, red eyes. And you can hear the... I haven't adjusted the volume, so I don't know if it goes up higher or not, but that's more than loud enough. So... Here, let's do a little playing with it. Oh, wow. No. <laughs> it goes much louder. So okay, I am very happy with the with the one at least. <laughs> um, and I no, actually I'm happy with both. Even if if this one doesn't end up working, it still looks awesome. I don't remember what I paid for this, but it was nothing what I should have paid for. Um, I'm thinking I paid two hundred for both, but I mean like that's four or five years ago. I I really honestly don't remember. I know they're going for three or four hundred each now, so. Either way, I made a killing on this one. So, anyway, so there is the uh, Spirit Halloween uh, Sinister Gothic Gargoyles. Um, man, you can't go wrong with these things. These things are fantabulous. 10 out of 10 all day long. Heavy duty. Sounds great. Looks great. Um, use them in a cemetery. Use them in a haunted house. Use them anywhere. They are fabulous, so highly recommend. Uh, it's an old school, obviously, because Spirit don't make things this good anymore, that they brought back, and I hope the new ones are as, as, are as high a quality, which I think I heard that they were, so that's wonderful. So, yeah, grab these. I'm not even going to say if you need them. I'm going to say grab these. They're too fantabulous to not. They're wonderful. 
All right. So 10 out of 10 cauldrons. All right. I know. Still got you my line to put together for you to, for you guys, for you YouTubers is what I can say, I guess. Yeah, I need to take some medicine. Anyway, <laughs> I'm, I'm trying, guys. I'm trying. Um, anyway, hope this helps some of you. Um, don't have any doubts on buying this one, man. I, three, four hundred dollars, even if they are that now at Spirit, definitely worth it. So, alrighty. Until next video, stay bubbly.